Okay guys, um, today I'm going to be showing you how to wire a 12 volt fan to uh, your Xbox 360 motherboard. Um, right now I'm using a 12 volt 80mm LED fan. Um, it was purple, kind of hard to find. Um, I'll show you a link for it. And compared to having the Molex, it only has um, just two wires to solder onto, the power and the ground, way simpler. And um, I'll be showing you how to test that. You just have to put it up to a 9 volt battery, even though it's not enough to power the whole thing, it'll let you know which is positive and which is negative. Once you know that, you can get your soldering iron all ready and take apart your Xbox. There's tons of videos on how to do that and turn it around and go to here under the power plug-in thing and the points that you're going to want to solder to are right here the third one to the left in the middle so in the middle on the farthest left that's the power and right above that to the farthest left is the ground these are the two easiest ones so I'm going to solder those and uh, show you what it's supposed to look like and follow on to the next step. So I'll be back. Okay, well I've soldered the power and um, the ground to the Xbox motherboard and covered the two connections with uh, some electrical tape. You want to use them separately, like two separate pieces of tape. One can go over the other. You just don't want the two points connecting because that will cause a short and you're going to have to throw away your Xbox if that happens. So be careful, use electrical tape. And the next part is to just um, get it set up in the Xbox uh, chassis and the case. Um, you're going to need to cut a hole in the case for the fan. Um, you, might, you want it to be like a little tight fit. So just have it like that. There's tons of tutorials how to cut a hole in there. Just line it up and draw it up and cut it out with the Dremel and sand it down. Everything will be good. So I'm going to put it in its chassis and put it in its case and okay, show you guys. As you can see, I have the fan in on the Xbox. And go ahead and turn it on. And there it is. And it is blowing air into it. You can tell if there's no air coming out. It actually might be blowing air out of it or in of it. I'm not sure, but either way it's doing good. As you can see it has four lights. And um, now I'm just going to go ahead and show you uh, how you're supposed to align the wires to make sure nothing shorts up. Okay, well, um, what I did, since it kind of had a pretty long wire, after putting it through the case, I have tape along here, here, and here to keep it from touching any of the capacitors to uh, short out the console. And as you already saw under there, I had tape protecting the original points. So that's it. Um, you can have a 120 millimeter fan or... I think that's the biggest you'd probably want. You can also get like a 50 millimeter or even a smaller one and you can actually fit it in there so you don't have to cut a hole in your case. But either way it's using a 12 volt fan source and that's what you can use. You can also use the DVD tray but that sucks power away from the DVD and you don't really want that. So um, thanks for watching and I hope I helped. I'll have a I'll show you what it looks like when it's all put back together. So, see you guys later. Okay, we have the Xbox put together all the way. And let's go ahead and turn it on. Second. And there it starts up. And the light, like, these lights up here are blue. But the fan's supposed to be purple. I don't really know. It looks like it's just a camera, but it really is purple, trust me.
see if it's a little better with the lights off. Lights. No, not really. But it feels like it's blowing out. Just like on these back fans back here, the talking whisper fans. If you can feel air coming out of it, that means it's blowing hot air out. And um, from before, these were running a little hot, but now they feel cooler. Same with this. So it does create a good effect if you have it blowing out. But either way, it's going to help if you have cold air blowing in. It's all just going to suck out by itself. So yeah, um, hope this helped. And if you have any questions, just go ahead and PM me on uh, YouTube. And remember to uh, subscribe for more videos and like this one if it, if it helped. So, uh, see